changes They happen every day And I see change Coming your way But the way that we're on the road, the way that we all go on the road yeah. It's like a tortoise You have to go on the road In, in a shell Manchester here. Okay. Do you find that you have to go on the that you had to go on the road, Absolutely. or that you still have to go on the road? Absolutely, had to. Yeah. Go but then there's a way to go on the road. Okay, because I'm and on the road now. there's a way to go on the road. You know, there's all kinds of ways to go on. The, mm -hmm. I mean, I feel like the road is necessary for anyone's yeah. career. Yeah. You know, because I mean, Absolutely. sure, you'll probably make more money on the road than you'll make on record well, sales, right? I mean, so you see, you guys, <laughs> no, you know what I know. Yeah, you guys have been surrounded by by security guards and stuff like that, the yeah. craziness. And it's you know, it's not that way for all of us. Sometimes it's much more mellow, mellow. hanging out with the band. It's lonely. It's not lonely. It's good. It's weird. But it's crazy. Me, do you do you like staying? I mean, I mean, it's like I mean, for women. Then. Okay, but then then then. then you give your life away for what in return A chance to see your name and that's why you learn Your manager, he's home and working away To keep you on the road and the moon from day to day But I see changes They happen every day And I see change One of the funniest things, and one of the, the people always they, they say, keep you're so outrageous in hotels, you know. I mean, why do you know why do hotels let you in? And I, I can't answer that question. Go in under another name. <laughs> that's probably the answer. <laughs> and I, one of the, the, the funniest stories, but I don't know if you're, if you're interested in one of mine. Yes. Oh, yeah. Hotel. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can write a book yeah. about it. <laughs> Go for it. One of the, we were in uh, Copenhagen, and we were doing a show there. Uh, and I got to my room, and, and I, was the, I was lucky enough to be the only member of the 32-member entourage that we carry with us to have a waterbed. And I thought, terrific. You know, thank you. And I phoned up the road crew, and I was on the seventh floor. And I phoned up my own personal boys and said, what we're going to do is to pick up this two-ton waterbed, two tons of water, put it in the lift, send it up two floors, and when the lift doors open on the ninth floor, the thing is just going to come out and explode, right? <laughs> so, no, that was the plan. So I, oh, I phoned up the road crew. What made you oh, think wow. of doing that? I, you know, I was so tired of looking at the same wallpaper, <laughs> speaking to the same operator. You know. Right. So I said, okay, fellas, there we go. And what we did, you know, we, we, we managed to get it halfway out of my... The, the little thing, you know, that it was encapsulated in. Mm -hmm. The waterbed surround. And we got it out, and the, the damn thing burst. And I was, like, sitting in a chair, because I was, you know, I was saying, okay, forward, forward, forward. You know, I don't do any manual work on the road. <laughs> 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 For God's sake, I'm an artist, this right? You know, I haven't forbid any, anything manual. But, <laughs> you know, I mean, I could dig roads. But... So I'm saying, okay, left a bit, left, and all of a sudden the thing burst. And I'm sitting there, and the water came up to there in the room. <laughs> and next thing, the water went, shoom, and the, fruit, the ceiling. Oh, no. In the room below, I had given way, right? <laughs> and then that went through, and the ceiling in the room below that <laughs> So when people say, Keith, have you ever smashed up a hotel room? I said, yes, well, three in one <laughs> fell swoop. <laughs> one, swell, <laughs> one swell flood, the one, you know, one. Yeah. Hi, I'm Ralph Bain speaking to you for...